Well done, boys. The last job went fine. There's no evidence or witnesses left against us. Thanks to your persuasive methods, they won't even squeak. Thanks, boss. We try to make you happy. <laughs> well, you certainly did. But today we're here for something else. Paulie has a pretty interesting proposal. Well, I met a guy from Kentucky, William Gates. Everyone knows that Kentucky makes the best homebrewed whiskey. Well, anyway, this guy almost threw up when he tried the whiskey which Morello sells here. When he gave me a drink of this stuff, they brew back there, forget about it. I won't drink anything else. So I asked him about it, right? He said it was no problem and that he could deliver me as much as I wanted. You know, I got jazz thinking about the dough he'd make on it. Well, I ordered a truckload of it. I said to myself, if it catches on here, we can make a bigger deal later. It would certainly be a good replacement for the loss of our Canadian. I like it. Nice one. Me too. So we're gonna pick up some beautiful booze. I'm already looking forward to it. Where are they hiding it? They'll meet us in the big parking garage. We have to be more careful than we were before. You'll get to the place by car with two other boys. They'll be your escort on the way back. You three pick up the truck and take it to our warehouse in Hoboken. The boys are already out in the yard waiting in the car. And bring me back a bottle so I can finally drink something decent. Count on it, boss. Get in. We're going for some medicine. Here, Tom. This might come in useful. Thanks. Wait for us here, boys. We'll be back in a little while. When we drive out, follow after us. Then, we'll have a shot at the warehouse. Sure, boss. They're waiting for you already, mister. Hey there, Bill. It's good to see you again. Hey, Polly. These are my partners who are good friends. They like the idea of working together. And they also like first-rate whiskey, which sure certainly is. That it is. The main thing is that Don Salieri likes it too. And since he's financing the whole deal, he's your first payment for the goods. Give Mr. Salieri my regards. I'm always happy to do business with people like him. You should be, Bill. You could hit it big with this. If this small delivery works out for us, we'll order a lot more next time. Take cover! What's going on? Jesus, who are they? Fire! Kill the bastards! Damn!
just kicked it. And you won't be no magnet now. What the hell was that, Polly? Who were those hoods? How should I know? Okay, okay. Well, we can't hang around here waiting for more of them to show up. Let's get the truck and get the hell out of here. Tom, you drive. I'll follow behind in one of the other cars. Tom, where you going? We gotta take the truck. I used a steering wheel once in a while. Be careful.
Okay, we did it. So it looks like Morello got in the way of things again, boss. We can't seem to shake off this bad luck. Boys, you won't believe this, but it's completely the other way around. The only one who really had bad luck this time was Morello. What? I found out who our Mr. Gates really was. And? Gates was never really from Kentucky. He was a small-time thief who stole the goods from Morello and wanted to sell them to us. Morello doesn't think that he almost stopped our deal, but that we pinched a truckload of his most expensive whiskey. I bet that bastard's happy now. Unbelievable! Well, that worked out just fine. Let's drink to that. To another success, boys. Salud. <laughs>